Hello everybody, this is week 10, our journey to conquer the world and let me see what we did uh, last week and uh, actually it's not Friday, it's uh, Thursday and uh, I'm, you know I'm always confusing Thursday, right? Between Thursday and Tuesday and the reason is because uh, tomorrow at morning I need to bring my car to service and I will not have time to record make the recording. Let's see what we have and uh, it's again it's uh, Thursday and also there is not too much progress I made. One thing I got distracted uh, with two things. I got distracted with these things, Lean Interpreter. I, I did some test drive, I was playing with it and actually I recorded the video. Another thing it's a TV show uh, which calls Dude Your Screwed. There is a... Oh my gosh, there is a three seasons. Oh no, I cannot. And it's really super addictive TV show and I, I'm, I'm having problem with sleep because I don't have too much time to sleep. Anyway, <coughs> let's go back to the game and um, it's here, right? So it was um, Friday... May 15th, some tweaks with, with inertia and you can see like there is one, two, three, four commits, fortunately. <coughs> implement scaling and add a green background to sprites. So I implemented scaling, if you know last week we were able only move the map and there is this um, scaling. So for mouse it's a mouse wheel, uh, so am I catching mouse wheel event. And I'm translating it to multi gesture event with um, angle zero because we don't care about angle, we are not going to implement rotating. Uh, this is the distance between two fingers. There is a center average, I guess it's average coordinates between two fingers and number of fingers. Then uh, um, also, I I was noticing there is uh, some gaps in between tiles and I was trying to fix this thing and I think I fixed it like this just uh, subtracting one pixel okay and uh, here is it actual calculation for scale uh, else I'm limiting scaling by 1000 on top and 10 on bottom this is actual calculation um, and you know I think with gap between tiles this thing helps so I disabled linear uh, filtering and just do nearest uh, I add the green background for all these tiles uh, let's see this mode swipe mode nice and it's that's it for this commit the next commit is tweak a coefficient for the scale so I run it <coughs> I run this thing on iPhone and I realized I need to have scaling more uh, more aggressive so I added make it three times faster um, add the car so uh, also I removed all log messages from here removing log messages and there is a class car and <coughs> uh, there is a some implementation for moving also I need the function sign which returns uh, negative if uh, sign negative, zero if value is zero, and one if uh, value positive. Also, there is implementation for tick, and it's dynamic tick, so it's cal calculating time between uh, from previous tick. Then uh, there is a variable which saying which kind of animation car have and right now it has um, three types of animation no animation moving horizontally moving vertically and rotate so if it's moving horizontally we are um, checking which direction we have to move the car so there is an animated x it's actually position of car uh, what we see right now and x it's kind of position where we want to put our car so uh, and um, distance between what we want and what is actual uh, specifies uh, direction when the car is going to move so I'm modifying animated X right and also I'm checking if we got the car in right position or 
actually we overshoot a little we are setting animation to none <coughs> same thing for y uh, for rotate is little bit different but ID is same and rotate different is because uh, angle right now I made the angle changing from uh, 0 to 3 to basically up to 4 right and uh, then we switching between angle 4 and 0 and basically 4 and 0 it's same angle we need to do some processing but ID is same and another thing after car rotate it it has to start moving forward so i i checked like if if we finished with animation rotation we are we are moving forward so it's switching to state animation state like vertically or horizontally so this is a header file for class car it has uh, x and y it's like at the position of car where we want to go direction it's north west south east and animation state non horizontally, vertically, and rotation. Initial direction is east, initial animation rotate, and also car has command. It's actually not command, it's a card, what car will have on, on top. And uh, this is the real position, current position of the car, animated x, y, and direction method tick. And uh, we initializing uh, previous tick to current tick. So I put bunch of like a different sort of map uh, with uh, rotating left here. This is like rotating right. This is rotating left. <coughs> also added a method to graph engine draw car. And why I cannot use draw sprite because draw sprite doesn't have angle. So draw car takes takes uh, angle. So as you see, I'm drawing car from animated x coordinate and animated direction and you can see i'm converting this animated direction to uh, how do you call this thing radian angle so radian angle it's angle which changing from zero uh, up to to pi right so zero is zero uh, pi divided by two it's 90 degree pi is 180 degree and 2 pi it's 360 degrees i'm removing logs and uh, on car tick and i didn't mention uh, car tick returns boolean and false means we do not need any actions and true means animation finished and we want to know what to do next so if car tick returns true we, we have to know what we want to do next so we're just reading from map and seeing what is underneath the ca uh, car so if if knob and actually i realize knob it's not knob it's actually means move forward so we're moving car forward and enabling an animation for like vertical animation or horizontal animation so there is a logging if there is a card turn right so we setting direction where we car needs to turn and setting animation to rotate similar thing for left and uh, in this commit I did not implement other commands. So I'm including car FPP and adding care variable to <coughs> game screen. Also adding sprite for car, also enabling alpha blending and there is a implementation for draw car. So we are loading sprite textures, uh, setting, getting the information about car sprite and I do not know, do you remember or not, like um, this thing holds like a sprite um, texture coordinates for car. Setting attributes, setting um, X and Y coordinates from here. Uh, and as I said, like S holds uh, texture coordinates for car. This and again, I put 0 0.5. I need to fix it and make it like normal. So it will, need, don't, will not need this coefficient i need to fix it mm, so what else and uh, what we do so as as you know like as i mentioned probably previously uh, we are doing translation uh, from last matrix to first matrix so first of all i'm moving the car uh, on the center of the so you see there is a uh, these coordinates right so i move the car to the center and then I'm rotating car and then moving 
back rotated car and then uh, I just moving car to make it from like uh, we have hidden height right and I'm making it uh, on the center so it's like <clears throat> minimum is uh, negative and maximum is positive so minimum is uh, for x it's negative white become and uh, maximum is white divided by two and for height is uh, same thing and then I'm scaling it so I'm making it from negative uh, one to one by x and from negative one to one by y, uh, y. Uh, so uploading the projection matrix to shader uh, picking picking up the texture zero uploading the array for vertices uploading array for text coordinates uh, and drawing okay so add the car here sprite types draw car takes x y x y and direction and uh, I added to uh, this operator which takes the command from map uh, some checking so if it's outside of map it returns uh, command right by default there is a new car as you can see it didn't have car now it has car ah our thing I uh, repi repainted rainbow and actually correct rainbow goes from top red and wallet on bottom but arrow say saying like we need to change like from red to yellow and as you can see like all these bells are colored red orange yellow green cyan blue and so on so it's kind of confusing i, I guess so i i changed the color order of colors for rainbow so that's it for this commit and in this commit i implemented all our commands so also i, I did some code refactoring um i called this routine just move forward forward uh, so you can see I moved it from here to here also I renamed common to card so car has sort of program card and <coughs> by default it's knob also I made the more interesting map level uh, and during the loading from this level I'll also loading x and y coordinates for car and it's I, I make it s letter s capital it's like a start starting point and car by default initialized to look at east so it will start moving this direction so this means read something from um, front right side of car so it will read c and put c on card then this means rotate uh, 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 right if the uh, car what car has on card <coughs> matching with front uh, right side of car and you can see here it's nope and it's not matching with C so it will not rotate it will go forward this is just go rotate right it will rotate right and go for bell C <coughs> and eventually I, it's supposed to play some sound right then rotate right again move rotate right again move um, then load things from front right side of car so it will load C then plus it's a rainbow so it will make C to D then rotate here rotate here rotate here and this thing is uh, put back what card has and it's D it will put instead of C D go here it's again load and now it's loading for of front and right side of car it's B so it will load B then rotate here go here and check with B and front uh, right side of car it's B it's matching so it will rotate and go again and like it will become E F G and so on so this is map so it's like I make it more interesting um, and then I'm matching animated X and Y with X and Y coordinates and here's it I write the method converting program common to sprite just matching like knob to knob right to right left to left right if to right if and so on uh, so now i can use this method to sprite instead of doing this switch again and again so i put to sprite here uh, draw car and also i draw small sprite size of uh, uh, 
kind of two eight so one one quarter quarter of the actual size of car so what kind of card has car so i just drawing it on top of car so finger down for direction like here is it for no it's car move forward so i as i mentioned i implemented it um front right car this thing returns what kind of command is on front right side of car and like right if if it's matching with what car has it turns right turns right so it's changing direction to right make a switching to animation right <clears throat> and then otherwise if it's not equal what on front um, you got it um, so it moves forward similar for left then in it means copy what on front right side of car to cart car and move forward out copy from car to front right side of car move forward inc increment and uh, also i did uh, rotation so then it's uh, goes beyond what uh, what kind of cars we can have it goes to zero and similar thing is fits so it goes to uh, 15 so move forward and for playing notes it's just moving forward i did not implement anything with sound engine for now and uh, this method returns what is on front right side of car so it's based on direction of course and blah 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 it's simple thing so uh, this thing this thing so like if letter s change card x and y coordinates and that's it and let's go for demonstration so you already see car is moving so uh, it's rotating here rotating here it did not rotate here because it had c and it's got c and like make it d then rotate here rotate here and it will load back d here then load b from here rotate checking with b it's equal to b so it rotates play d it doesn't play it's not implemented rotate rotate load from d increase d becomes e load back e so d becomes e got b from here rotate checking with b rotate so it's going to load e increase e become f so it's my becomes f and it's going to load back f here upload i don't know f gets b checking with b so plays f load f then increase it's going to become g got g upload g here got b check with b rotate compare with b let's say it like this so now it's going to play g boom then load g here increment it's becomes a so got a got b compare with b plays a to load a increment become b and now it's going to be interesting part because this thing becomes b and b it's the last command in my set of commands so it's going to um, over over overflow right and i made it so it's will become to knob so load b increase and you can see it becomes knob so we eventually it will upload knob booms nothing so it just will run here but so it will load knob again and will increase and it will become rotate right so it will upload right and then next time it will go here 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 and will turn right goes for rainbow play with b goes here 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 and because it's will be i guess um i don't know what <laughs> so let's see oh so it's increase b, uh, rotate for some reason it becomes <laughs> Ah, load this thing i'm sorry this thing so it's so it's going to go like in the circle so our program is going to do in the circle and play infinite time b beam 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 so you got idea so we what these things what i made um this week um let's fast go and look statistics and i'm pretty sure it's not looking good unfortunately I have no idea how to make attraction. Uh, I need to figure out this thing. So six views only. 
only six views it's crazy so um let's go to itunes connect sales and trends actually i i do not need to look for last seven days yeah for last seven days and you know zero 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 and like three units uh at very beginning of the week so it's it's not good um that's it oh yeah let's i didn't show total amount right uh not here analytics for last seven days so yeah total views 13 zero subscribers um that's it um thank you for watching hopefully see you next uh, friday um hopefully i will make better progress with game and actually i have pretty good feeling about this game it's going to be interesting challenging game so subscribe share like please it will help to grow my channel and uh, help with sales goodbye